One of the many weaknesses of the 6-liter Power Stroke was its penchant for generating a lot of heat. While the trucks are equipped with oil coolers, the stock component often isn't up to the task in aggressive applications. That's where AFE's Blade Runner oil cooler comes in. The removal of the oil cooler cover and mounting assembly is first, so we started by removing the two bolts that secure the EGR coolant supply cover, the eight bolts that hold on the oil filter mounting assembly, and we also removed the sensor. Once all of the bolts are off, we pried off the EGR coolant cover and port, along with the oil filter mounting assembly. Next, both flange nuts on the top side of the oil cooler cover can be removed, then flip over the cooler assembly to remove the two mounting bolts on the underside of the oil cooler cover. Placing the cover in a vise, we pried off the cooler cover from the cooler. With the cover off, we started to replace all of the O-rings in the cover, filter mount, EGR cover, and the threaded insert in the cooler cover. Set up the new oil cooler with its o-rings and install the cover on top of the cooler. Once the cover is on, tighten the two flange nuts on the top of the cover along with the two bolts on the underside. Replace the oil filter mounting assembly on the cooler cover along with the EGR coolant supply cover. Replace the bolts in both of these pieces and tighten to spec. We replaced our last two gaskets on the cooler assembly along with reinserting and tightening down the sensor. We then installed the new oil cooler assembly on the engine and continued with our engine refresh project. Remember to replace the oil pump inlet strainer when installing the oil cooler back on the engine to prevent future engine failure.